What's up guys? Yes, you guessed it right. Today, I am going to be telling you about... Well, honestly, I can't tell you much because Prujo called us and they said, Hey, it's in our glamour showroom right now. Bobby called me and I'm like, go, go, go. So I went, went, went without any information at all. Came in and I saw the salesman just driving it through. He doesn't know anything at all. No news, no nothing. So here, you're seeing it first on Evil Malaysia. And that's our advert for today. Okay, guys, so in front of me, I have the 308 GTI. And the first thing that caught my eye is... I'm not even gonna go like all template this year, but... It's a freaking man, oh man! Woohoo! Okay, now I'm just gonna take you around the outside. Take a look at this. So there are limited units in uh, Persia, in Malaysia. Don't know how much it is. No pricing, no nothing yet. Looking from the front, you see it's... It looks I this again. The headlights seems like... I, I think I got affinity with Peugeot. Every time there's a new launch, every time... Just basically whatever you do with Peugeot, I'm there lah, huh? really affinity. Look at it. Okay, honestly the blue and the red a bit tacky for me. But hey, it all compensates because it's a freaking man, oh man. So yeah, again, chrome detailing on the side. Check out those rims. Nice. Nice rims, going to the back. It's kind of quiet, I started it up just now. Can let you guys have a little listen later. I'm just taking you out, taking you through the uh, exterior. And you can't see, but it's actually a sunroof. So let's go in through the uh, back seat first. Okay, the doors are really heavy. Whoa! Really, really heavy doors. Going to the inside. Yes, you can open it. Then you have a... Ta-da! And it's so nice, so clear. Next best thing to drop the top, slide the top. So, looking at the inside, what do you have? I think these are Alcantara seats, if I'm not wrong. Alcantara seats. Look at it. With red stitching as well. I don't know what all car brands doing with like black and red lah. Apparently it's very nice. Guys, black and lime green please. Thank you. So, there you go. You have... Hmm. Yep. You have a handrest here. So, a bit... It's not that spacious. A bit crampy. But hey, it's a sports car, damn it! And you can access the boot from here. Yep, yep. There you go. This is the back seat. No USB ports, no nothing. Very simple. Yeah, really, there's nothing else inside here. Again, it's just one compartment here. See? Brilliant. This. And then nothing else here. Just this. Brilliant, brilliant, brilliant. Um, it's really a very basic car. Nothing much. That's all you have. Very good. You have isofix mounts here. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yes, yes. And uh, yeah. That's about it for the back. That's it, guys, for the back. Let's go to the front. Okay, going into the driver's seat. What I like about this car is actually very, very, very simple. I mean, check it out. See, this is directed to the driver. This is what I love. And check these out. The build feels okay. Not too bad. This, of course, like, yeah, normal plastic lah, huh? But not too bad. Check it out. You have... Oh, what is this? Oh, wow! So you can actually do this. So you do this, and then you have a cup holder. And if you decide not to, you can have this. Wow! First time I'm seeing a car that has that feature. Very nice. Check it out. Middle console. Where are the USB ports? You have one here. And that's about it. Okay. CD player, I'm guessing. Not too sure. It's very simple. I'm so amazed. What about the aircon? Le? Maybe aircon is here. Let me just try, try. And uh, this is steering wheel. So small. It's... Wow, it's so small. This is the car for me, la, guys. I mean... 6-speed manual transmission. And yeah, it's very petite. Very snug. And I love the seats. Take a look at the seats. Racer seats, la, this one. Ayo. Oh, and check it out. It's all full. 
you know why there's very little space at the back because it goes all the way to my thighs here yes if you're gonna say like you being with your show legs and all that screw you guys man seriously check it out the stitching the build quality is actually very good it's damn heavy guys wow check it out yep yep this is how it looks like mm-hmm mm -hmm. yes yes okay i'm just gonna start it so to move my chair front ah i have to put, pull the lever at the bottom so you see here you have to have to pull here yep yep and uh, press the clutch press start very very quiet guys so everything starts aircon starts yep your aircon everything is here let's see how the infotainment system is like oh wow oh fuel level low ah damn and i thought i could go drive it man very simple you just have two sticks one here one here very simple very nice Yep, and then you have traction control on and off. I place to put stuff here, compartments here. And that's about it, guys. Really, that's all. It's a very simple car. I like that it's so simple. You don't have much room inside here. Oh, yep, you don't have much room inside here. Very simple car, very nice. I really love it. It's simple, nice. This is so important. This, this. Oh my gosh. I really love it. And this is the killer to the Golf GTI. And guess what? I'm the first person to sit inside here. Well, actually not the sales guy was. He was driving it in. But damn, son. Oh, they have another one here. Okay, I really, I, I don't like this on Condi cars. But I know that it's usually here. Don't really like it. And let me see how to adjust the steering. It's just here. Yep. So you just, it's telescopic. So again, I need two hands for this. You push it. Yep. You see, you pull it out, pushed it in. Yep, it's all here. Ah, oh, damn. From what I see, let's try to jack it up. Oh, you jack the seat up from here, so you jack it up. Yep, like pumping, like churning butter, yo. You, okay, it feels very sportish. I'm actually sitting quite low, feels very sportish. Though I like it, it's snug. People like me, loving it, loving it. Not too sure how Bobby would feel here, but... It has this type of steering wheels, which means that the bottom is flat for, you know, big thighs, long legs. But if you go all the way to the back, at the back, you have no space anymore. Nothing. But yes, I like the car. I really do. The touch, the feel, very, very nice. And yes, this is the 308 GTI for you. And this is the Golf GTI killer. Not too sure how the Golf GTI interior looks and how it feels. Can't wait to try it out. Can I drive, Perjo? Can I? Please? 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 Okay guys, that's it. Bye! Okay guys, so I just got news that this is 270 horsepower and 330 newton meters of torque. And it's going, not sure about the price yet, but about 200,000-ish plus minus. Yeah, they're still finalizing the price, but wow. I, I really like this car though. I mean, just look. It lets you have that feeling on unlimited headroom. So, if you can't drop the top, slide the top. Yes, yes. And this is very, very nice. The meter cluster. Just look at it. Wow. Very nice. Very nice angle. And this car also has LSD, limited slip differential. So, yes. That's what we have. That's all the info we have. And uh, yeah, if you want to check it out, come to Peugeot Glen Marie. Limited units available. So if you're interested, ask Peugeot.